Now, as you can see, the cards look like they're in a very strange angle in my hand here. Some people think I use magnets, strings, all different sorts of things. But as you can see, absolutely nothing is holding up this deck. And if the wind blows just right, you could actually see the cards spin out of my hand. I even touch the deck and tell me a number between 1 and 15. 11. 11. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. The 11 is your selection. This is my selection. The two cars are the same. The first time I ever made a wish on a star, it was a very clear night, and there was a full moon rising up over the horizon. Now using this napkin, I'm going to tear a picture of the full moon. That means I'm going to make a circle. Using just one tear, right here, one single tear, right through the napkin. Uh, actually, it's a whole bunch of little tears all in the same line, but you know, it's the same effect. Now I'm not going to finish tearing the napkin, instead I'd like you to hold on to the pieces and you'll tear them out yourself. Now you hold those, let's see how well I've done here to see if I've got a good circle. Not bad, not bad with one tear. Uh, do you see the man in the moon? That's me. Now as I said, the moon was just rising up over the horizon and I looked to the right and there was the first star and I made a wish. I said starlight, star bright. Are you familiar with that? Yeah, yeah that's one of my better works. Uh, actually, I made a wish that I could become a magician and my wish came true, uh, judging from this. But you know, that's really not that uh, fascinating. There's something else I think I should have wished for. And if you let me see those pieces, I'll show you what it is. You see, I should have wished for that star because then I could have all the wishes I wanted. So I usually use a half dollar. However, if I ever had a chance to travel, for example, to Africa, then I would use it an African coin. If I ever had a chance to travel to England, then I would do it with an English penny. If I ever had a chance to travel, say, to the Orient, or at least to a good Chinese restaurant, I'd do it with an Oriental coin. Unfortunately, I never really get a chance to travel much at all, so I can only use a half dollar. Carol, look, 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 look. It's a uh, poker, poker exhibition. Poker exhibition. Shuffle and shuffle and like this. And now, cut like this. And now it's a two-hand poker. Eh? I, give, I deal you one by one, one, two, three. Four and five. Is it uh, uh, good as five? Yes, yes, okay, five. The other card, no importa. Five. We are going to see what happens with five card and my five card. You have, you have seven, 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 and seven. Four of a kind. Yes. It's good. You, you can, you can uh, bet a lot of. Yes. But it's not enough for me. It's not enough for me. Because I have, <laughs> I have a eight, king, 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 and uh, an ace. King, no, but you win? Yes. You win, you win. No, uh, excuse me, something, something, uh, oh, oh, no, no, no. Ah, I have an idea, I have an idea. If I can put this ace in a king, I have four kings and I win. Okay, I am going to do. With a king, eh? Look, 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 look. Ta -ta -ta -ta, chess, and nothing happens, nothing happens. It's so difficult, no? So difficult, the sleeves are very difficult, very difficult. Again, 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 again. Again. Shack! And no, oh, so difficult, eh? When, when it's so difficult, I make like this and I transform in four aces and I win, uh, and I'm very happy with this. And now, thank you very much indeed, and bye bye. Ta ta!